Welcome to this demonstration, which is one in a series from our white paper, EMC Management Integration for Microsoft Private Cloud, using EMC Symmetrics VMAX 10K, EMC VNX 5700, EMC Storage Integrator for Windows Suite, and Microsoft System Center 2012 SP1. In this architecture design, you can see the Microsoft components SCVMM 2012 SP1, SCO 2012 SP1, and SCOM 2012 SP1 working with the ESI service, the ESI management packs, ESI PowerShell to automate virtual machine deployment, automate storage provisioning with ESI PowerShell for EMC hardware. Creating and adding an EMC LAN to our host in Microsoft SCVMM 2012 Service Pack 1. Open the SCVMM console and go to the storage node. Click create logical unit and start the wizard. We choose pool 1 and it's on a VNX 5700. Input the name and the size of the LUN you require. In this case it's going to be 50 gig. You can view the script that will be generated. to create the LUN. Click OK. Go to Classification and Pools. And the new LUN is successfully created in Pool 1. So let's go and look at the properties of the host that we want to create the disk on. Now, you could think we could add a LUN, but the Add Disk button is still grayed out. So the first thing to do is to allocate capacity. And this allows the host or host group to see the LUN. So we are choosing the host group single. And we're allocating that 50 gig LUN from the VNX 5700. And in the group single, we have a, a single server. And now, when we go, we can add the disk. choose the LUN that's available and all the other information is automatically filled in. We decide on a drive letter or mount point if we want, in this case a drive letter. And if we go onto the host in computer management, we'll see the drive is being created and being assigned as E drive with a capacity of 50 gig. And now it's visible and usable on the host. Thank you for viewing our demo from our white paper EMC Management Integration for Microsoft Private Cloud, which is available on emc.com and community.emc.com.